Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Revitalize the Total Woman podcast with your host, Lakeisha McKnight. Remember, this podcast has been brought to you just to help and reach out to business women and help them to strive towards reaching total wellness in their lives. You, the businesswoman, you, the entrepreneur, right? You could be a coach, an author, a speaker. You could be a network marketer, a direct sales representative, whomever you are, or just aspiring to be in business. You could be a corporate woman about to make the transition into becoming an entrepreneur. Who knows? Or even just in a corporate world. Listen, listen. Thank you so much for listening in. We have women from around the world who actually listen to this podcast. This podcast is actually a media outreach to reach more people in other places that we can't physically physically get to at this particular moment. But we're, you know, in various places around the world, I tell you. Now, this podcast is the Media Outreach for Women of Elevation Career Services International. This is a nonprofit based, again, in Chesapeake, Virginia. Uh, But we do have a movement called the Revitalized Women's Movement that helps us to be able to have events and different activities virtually so that we can reach more people, more women specifically. Now, the women that we really tend to focus in on are women who have unfulfilled career goals and also women who have been battered and abused and now need empowerment, encouraging. They need some love to help guide them, right? Give them the training they need. And so that's why we're here. So let's get going. Today, as you may see, our topic being simple strategy to become a creator. Simple strategy to become a creator. I'm just going to give you a nugget today. Not going to keep you long, but a nugget that's going to be able to help you to tap into that creative you. Because as you may have heard already in a previous episode, we've been made in the image of God. And God is a creator. And we have that ability to tap into that creative side of ourselves. Okay? We can tap into that creative side of ourselves. And so we have to be able to do this. We have to be able to do this. And what better way? than to be able to tap into that side. So here we go. Now, the nugget that I really want to share, and I'm trying to, of course, give some women some time if you do want to listen live, because, again, this is the live recording. We're going to go back and edit it just a little bit. But right now, this is the live recording. Okay. so uh, what I want to just share with you at this particular moment is that the way a a simple way that you can tap into this creative side of you is by simply getting to know yourself better. Get to know you better. Find out what your likes are, what you dislike, right? And you can create something around what you like and what you really have a passion to do. You see, there are many problems around the world, problems around us, and God uses people to bring about solutions. And you have the unique ability to solve a problem. What is it that's burdening you the most? Think about that burden. Write that burden down. And then you can simply create a solution for it, a unique solution. It can be a service, a product. It can be a group, an organization, a movement. But you can create a solution. And that's simply really what I wanted to share. A simple strategy is getting to know yourself, getting to know that burden. What is it that burdens you the most? that you have a passion for. You see, I have a passion because I don't like to see women waste talent. I don't like to see women hidden in the shadows and not using what God has given them. I don't like to see that and that is a burden for me. Women who are downtrodden just wasting their lives and wasting talent, that is a burden, right? 
That is a strong bird and I've seen it in my family, right? I've seen it, you know, in my in the neighborhood in which I grew up. Even people that I went to school with wasting talent. I've seen women pass away and of course at an early age wasted talent because they were in the wrong place at the wrong time. But you don't have to do that. You don't have to waste talent. You can look at that burden that that's really been on your heart and create something amazing. Simply amazing. And so we're using this and we're we're giving you these strategies this in, this nugget here so that you can go forward and do something amazing with your life. And we're going to be continuing to give you these nuggets every day. So definitely come back here on tomorrow at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time to get another nugget on how you can tap into the creative side of you and get some ideas, get those juices flowing so that you can do what it is that God has called you to do. So again, thank you so very much for tuning in. Remember, this podcast also supports the three core values of the nonprofit Women of Elevation. And those three core values are create, relate, and elevate. We're focusing on the creative side right now in this quarter, right? And so definitely tune back in. Thank you so much for listening. And I want you to be plugged in. We're going to inform you about all, all types of things that we have going on with the nonprofit, with the movement, um, so that you can be connected and get involved. We're from wherever, from wherever you are, you'll be able to get involved. <laughs> but thank you so much for listening in. You be blessed, and I'll definitely be back on tomorrow. Take care.